Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing swatches of this acrylic powder and it's called Chisel. So I'm just going to go ahead and be reviewing it and let you guys know if you guys should buy it or not. I got them for $12 each and I think that's a really good deal. Two ounces as opposed to one ounce for $12. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the swatches for you guys so that you guys can see. So the first color that I'm going to go ahead and open is Neon 1 and it's like that lemon juice type of like you know neon yellow that a lot of people you know get and want that's the top came off but okay so I'm gonna go ahead and get my brush I'm just gonna give this a random brush to swatch it with So um, they basically said that this is a dipping powder, but it's like a two-in-one and you can use it for multiple things. This color that I have is Chisel Nail Art and it's neon number five. JC Beauty Concepts. So y'all should go check them out. I like them on there. Okay. I'm gonna do my feet and spread this thing out. And y'all, I'm not gonna lie, it's really smooth. Like, I have to give them this for $12. Baby, she. I'm gonna make another purchase. Like, you don't have to overdo it with this, and I really like that about it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and fill in the areas that I feel need some love. The next color is gonna be um, <clears throat> neon number four. But as you guys can see, really, really cute. And that's a really cute orange. And I want to put it against something like so you guys can really see. Really cute. Okay, so this color is um, solid 58. I got this as opposed to getting um, the neon purple, which I kind of regret because the color doesn't really look like how it looks in the container when you apply it. Like it looks like a, a plum kind of like Barney purple I don't know how to explain it but I don't want to say I don't like it because I might end up liking it if I use it on the set so we gonna have to see about this one <laughs> okay so this purple I like I like how it looks like it's not ugly it's just a little bit too dark 
for what I wanted it to go with. So I'm gonna have to find another purple or try to mix some white acrylic into this to try to get it, the color to like brighten up. As you can see, once I apply it with the monomer, it goes like two, three shades darker than what it looks like in the container. So um, I won't use this with my neon acrylics because I think it'll tone it down a bit too much, but I still like the purple, so I'm not mad. I just know that I have to get a neon purple if I want to do neons with it because of how dark it is. But yeah, it's not a big deal. And I'm just shaking it up to see if like that makes a difference in how um, the powder looked when I applied it. And it was pretty much the same thing. So I just have to get, and I'm not disappointed y'all. I'm not mad at all because it's not a bad color. Like it'll go nice with some pinks, you know, it'll go nice like around, you know, prom season or, you know, homecoming I could see me um playing with this color and doing some things with some gold so I'm not mad but I just have to get a neon purple <laughs> okay the next color that I'm looking into is um solid 13 this one is not neon also there was a neon blue but I didn't like it. I decided that this blue would be better and it just is like really it just is really nice so I decided to get this blue instead Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go in and put the color on to this now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do like, you know, a good enough bead. This should be fine. And I press it in there at first because I want the color to disperse. Then I'm gonna go ahead and press in and drag down. Just press it in. Okay, I'm gonna get a little bit more because I don't want it to separate or anything like that. So I'm gonna go with some more and drag that down. I don't know. And this is how the blue looks. It's like a dark nipsey blue. So the next color is going to be neon 2, neon green. Um, you guys can't really see it that well. It looks Honestly, like, that's what I have to say about these colors. They look way better in the flesh, like, in person. So I'm just going to get rid of this, throw it out. All right, so these are all the colors that I purchased today, um, just on the little color wheel. And as you guys can see, um, some of them are vibrant because they're neon, and then the others are just um, a solid color like the purple and the blue. And um, this is the blue, which I really like. I love this green. This purple gonna have to grow on me because uh -uh, I just, I don't know, for right now I can't. I just don't like it, but. <laughs> Um, this is like the orange, the coral looking orange, um, it's neon, and then um, you have the pink and the yellow, and I love those colors. I'm honestly happy with all the colors except for the purple one, like it's just so dark, it's like why are you that dark, why are you like, it's not that deep, but Hopefully it comes in handy for like another set by itself, like with some gold or something. But that's the only color I'm pretty disappointed in because 
like it was like a cat bitch like why would you do that so now i have to go find a purple that i actually like and i'm gonna go ahead and buy like another blue because this is like a nipsey blue i got it because of the color but i need like some lighter tone blue so this is just my first little acrylic haul because they were so cheap i think you guys should definitely um get some because they're 12 dollars for two ounces as opposed to getting one ounce for fifteen dollars for most of these people selling acrylic so if you're just trying to you know get more bang for your buck then i suggest you try this out especially if you're just starting and practicing or um if you just need some more acrylic colors i highly recommend that you guys get this i really like how it applies and um this system ombre is beautifully like it, and the, the thing about this system is that like it tells you what colors ombre nice with what colors like they have different shades that look nice ombre into each other and they tell you what colors are solid what are glitters what are shimmers and i really like that about the system and i think you guys should definitely try it out and if you guys do dipping you can definitely dip with this so you know i'm not a dipper i don't dip but if i ever wanted to try it out i got some acrylics that i could you know play with but be sure to like and subscribe to my channel thank you guys so much for supporting my page i'm almost at 200 subscribers ew, ew, ew. <laughs> thank y'all but um y'all have a nice day and see you guys next time bye